Get done. Get done, son. Yeah, we're destroying it. I don't even know where... Seago, where are you? Oh, yep, he can't swim. <laughs> Poor guy. Let's do it. Let's take it on. Let's, let's absolutely murder everyone. So let's hop back in the boat. Let's get away from this... What? Okay, this is officially the weirdest island I have ever been to. Hey, what's going on guys? I'm Zombie Gaming here again and welcome back to another episode of Cube World guys. We are on episode 12 and last time it was our last day in the desert. Look at all we explored. I actually went from that last pyramid we left off at around this area. I went back and I found that this biome is a snow biome uh, and we're not going to go for it. I decided against it because I'd rather go through this ocean. And the town's super far away, but that might give us a chance to just explore the uh, explore the ocean a little bit. But I actually, what kind of sucks? I'll probably go back there later. Uh, I got a water ice just now from killing a bat uh, that was just right over here on this island, and there were at that lake over there there were plus four spitters, so that would have been so cool. But guys, today we are starting a new leg of this adventure. Going into the ocean, I've already got my boat equipped, and I'm probably actually just going to de-equip Rodriguez, because I don't want him to... He's just going to be... He's not going to be with us, really, uh, when we're at least traveling, but here's... A, for those of you who haven't seen the ocean, I think it's pretty dang awesome, if I do say so myself. Uh, there's tons of kinds of fish. There's sharks, piranhas. What is this, lantern fish? Oh, yeah, there's this guy fighting a bunch of piranhas over there. But, uh, yeah, there's tons of stuff to explore. Uh, it's freaking... I think it's cool. Uh, it's not the most entertaining, I must say, but, uh, there are many, like, there are different islands that you can check out that have temples or forests and all kinds of dungeons on it. So today we're just gonna be starting off this adventure in the ocean. It's a little bit foggy, I don't know why. I might let it render up a little bit. Oh, a seagull. I Oh, dude, I've never found one before, but I have the pet food for it. Dude, yes. This is like one of the few pets I've never gotten before. Wow. That I've never even seen before. Holy cow, look at him, dude. I don't know what to name him, but dude, that's awesome. I, I don't think I've ever had a bird pet in Cube World. I know you can... Can you... Yeah, you can get parrots. Dude, seagull, you're awesome. I'm actually going to leave him out because... Uh, he's not really needed right now, and uh, you know he's a, he's a creature of the sea, and I can just teleport him to me when he gets too far away, and he'll just oh man, all right. But the ocean, dude, it's super disorienting. Like if you look away and you go like if I, and if I like turn myself around or something like that, it gets confusing. It's just blue everywhere and freaking a ton of mountains and stuff. A little bat. Why are there bats just flat out right in the, right in the water, all everywhere? Yeah, I don't know why it's so so foggy today, guys. It's it usually does that. Oh, I'm going in the complete wrong direction. See, see what did I tell you guys? What did I tell you? Uh, I think it's it did that with the desert too. I think it's just when, when I, when we get into a new, a new biome, it takes a little bit to render up the chunks and everything. But look at us on this boat. Sailing the ocean. Mm-hmm. Okay, let's make sure I'm not, like, going in the wrong direction. We're gonna head straight to the town. If we pass a dungeon, uh, I'll, I might check it out, see if it's worth worth my time. But, uh, oh, actually, yes, I did level up uh, by the time that I was trying to get to that other biome. And it looks like we have four skill points to spend. Uh, so now that we are in sailing, I am going to put all those points, or are in the ocean, I'm gonna put all those into sailing. Because that's what we're gonna be doing for for this next part of the journey. Uh, that's really gonna be our main mode of travel. And let's let's just take a peek. Oh, hello. Fish are so easy to kill, guys. I'm just I'm gonna be flat out honest. <laughs> can I don't think he can swim. Can you know? I think he can. He, it's a little derpy, but uh, he can do it. Let's just see. I don't, I would like to find a portal. I know I didn't find the one in the desert, 
but I'd like to find a portal in the ocean because I don't know what it looks like. The ocean, I've traveled through a lot of oceans, but I haven't, uh, I haven't, like, spent a bunch of time and, like, seen a bunch of stuff. Oh, hello, Piranha Boss. You're freaking huge. Let's do this. Seagull. Ikoka. Oh, these are blue, dude. Wow, okay. Mm, okay. Getting the three ready. We're just going ham on this, on this bad boy. Mm, mm. Get back here, man. Get done. Get done, son. Yeah, we're destroying it. I don't even know where... Seagull, where are you? Oh, yep, he can't swim. <laughs> Poor guy. He's still really cool, though. I'm glad I have him as a pet. Okay. Oh, we already have, like, four milk chocolate bars. Hey, you're a jerk. Stop. All right. So the, the ocean's got a little more of a chance to render in, and it is looking beautiful as ever. And we don't have, like, air supply or anything in the ocean, so I don't think... I don't think that's really gonna matter. Let's actually get Rodriguez out. Let's, uh... Where is he? What? Okay. There we go. Let's get him out. Let's, uh, let's just chill underwater for a little bit. I know there are underwater caves. That is, a uh, that is a thing. I'm really unfamiliar, though. I don't know if all dungeons spawn on separate islands or, or what, man. I I'm excited to explore this. Because... Okay, we don't we didn't need that stuff at all, but that's okay. Cause I really I just haven't had too much of a chance to ex really really go in depth in exploring an ocean. Uh, and you guys can check the mini map. Uh, always has just uh, it only so shows what's on the surface. It doesn't show what's underwater. So if there's a big island, we'll probably see it. Oh hello, lemon fish. I don't think you can tame those, but it's cool that the the ocean has its own complete set of different mobs that, like, those small fish, I'm assuming, replace just the normal mobs, and then these guys replace, like, skull bulls and whatnot. I don't think they're st as strong as skull bulls, but they just replace just standard hostile creatures. Let's see what's over this ridge. Not too much. Uh, there are some, I, I've, from what I've seen from oceans, yeah, yeah, here. There's one right here. It's kind of like this weird terrain that gets like it looks like something like was like crawling on the ground or something i might be able to show you guys a little better later on oh hello okay this this is probably a forest if i were to guess uh depending on these are pretty pop or pretty yeah uh, popular is a is a decent word choice they're pretty common in the ocean biome <sighs> this looks like a beetle a beetle island man i don't want to I don't want to kill beetles. They're just annoying. Is this really not a forest? Wow, if this isn't a forest, I'm honestly surprised. Yeah, I guess it's not. Rodriguez, what you doing? What you doing, mate? Get up here. I'm gonna ride you away. Let's go. Heading on into the forest. Uh, there's a parrot to my right. We're, we're going on a on an ocean safari tour, guys. Mm. Dude, I'm getting so off track. Okay. Wow, there's just... I'm just looking at everything. Oh, man. Kind of like the desert. Just the first day we explore, just kind of get a feel of what it's like. So, I'll have to keep my eye out for uh, the rune stones of the portal. Because the portal has a special kind of stones, and I'll probably see it. I'll probably know when I see it, but... I just, I, I want to find a portal for more than just the grasslands. I was kind of super, super lucky when we found the portal for the grasslands, so I'm, uh, I'm kind of hoping we can find some more. Um, but I'll, I'll see if we can find some, some more of that. What the heck? See, this is kind of what I'm talking about. The, the ocean terrain can get really, really weird. I want to find some more of the, the stuff that I was talking about. Yeah, kind of like that, except it's like even more. Uh, it's, like, way bigger and stuff. But, yeah, I want to... I want to find some underwater caves sometime, too. I wonder if... Watch us, like, find diamond in an underwater cave. But there's a bunch of just fish that hang out at the bottom. I don't think we're really going to fight them, mostly. So, this might be a little slow for XP, guys. I'm just... I'm just saying. We might not level up, uh, except for only in dungeons. But let's just speed on over to this town. Uh, 
Excuse me, I'm sorry for burping. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, we're about ten minutes in to the video, and I don't want to bore you guys to death. I think, I think you guys have gotten, or hopefully have gotten, a good feel of what the ocean is going to be like with us exploring it and stuff like that. We are chasing the fog down. No big deal, we're just, we're chasing it. We're almost, yeah, we're almost getting ahead of it. But, uh, once we get to the town, we'll be able to see what it has. See if it has a legendary lamp. I know we already have one, but I think it would always be cool to see a legit one. That would, like, make this seed. Because we've had such sweet biomes in this, there'd be freaking legendary lamps and stuff. Okay, can't see what's coming. Let's see if we can, see if we can dodge it. Okay, yep, made it through. We need to go this way a little bit. Mm-hmm. Is this a, is this a dungeon? What? There's island dungeons? Are you legit? Are you serious? What? I've never seen this before. Dude. Or is that just the name? Crosal Island. Whoa. Hang on, let's check this out real quick. I don't know if we'll take it on, just because it's kind of like an introductory episode to this. Holy crap. Okay, those that's like one XP each. <laughs> Crosal Island. It looks like humans, and they're just super easy. Uh, you know, this could be a little side quest. Let's do it. Let's take it on. Let's let's absolutely murder everyone. <laughs> Destroyed. Yep. Sorry, guys. Uh, you're all gonna die today. I'm decimating your population. Hey, you. I'm not even. I I don't even think I take damage from these guys. Here, shoot me. I don't even take damage. <laughs> That's great. This is great. I don't even take damage from these guys. I don't even have to worry about them. I just need to find the boss. Uh, a boss? Hello? Whoa. Oh, that's a werewolf. Why are there... This is such an interesting island. With werewolves and everything? Like, okay, I found the boss. Let's kill him. Let's take him on real quick. I'm stealthing it up. And we're gonna wreck some people. Oh yes. Oh, the wreckage. The wreckage is so real. I'm destroying this person. Man. Okay, it's there's freaking helicopters. My window's open, so if you guys can hear that, I do apologize. Is that like a jester? Yeah, it is. What the heck is going on? This island. This is the true misfit island, guys. Holy crap. Oh, dude, he cloned me. All right. Well, let's get the balls out of here. No point in staying here. Uh, town. Hello, town. Okay. Onward this way. But yeah, guys, like I said with the fog and stuff, it may be a little laggy as we load up all this new terrain. But, uh, I'm not too worried. So let's hop back in the boat. Let's get away from this. What? Okay, this is officially the weirdest island I have ever been to. A minotaur? Really? Really? I thought those only spawned in Lava Lands. Wow, okay. Goodbye, island. Screw you. <laughs> Man. Wow, okay. That was weird. <laughs> Let's never run into one of those again. I mean, the XP was hardly even worth it. We got 10 XP for the boss. Jeez. We're about to hit another island here, too. So I guess islands are just overworld areas that spawn certain kinds of enemies just like a dungeon. Oh, hello. We caught up to the fog. Okay, whew. So, I don't think we got, what kind of stuff? I think monkeys can spawn here. Not sure about alpacas. Uh, we definitely wanna look out for spitters and stuff. Penguin, oh, this is a temple island. I gotcha, okay. Well, I'll see, uh, I'll see. I'll see what it looks like, what color it is. All right, Rodriguez, let's check this out. Temple of Tarawain. Boy, that's a weird name. Thank you, name generation, for picking such a beautiful name. All right, so we'll pass this up. These are just whites. Honestly, guys, I'm not even sure if this ocean is going to be worth it. Uh, I'm at least going to show you guys, and we're going to spend... Whoa, this looks deep. At least a couple episodes in here. But uh, to be honest, guys, I'm not... I'm not looking to spend a whole lot of time here if, if all these dungeons are just white. Uh, which is kind of like the desert, but at least the desert was... had something, you know, 
other than water. <laughs> and, uh, it had some good dungeons, too. So, we'll see. Because I'd rather save temples and stuff for the jungle. Because the jungle is probably my second favorite biome next to, uh, next to the desert. So, we'll just have to see. Okay, this looks like the island that the village is on. So, we'll take a look. We'll land ho. Land ho. Let's check this out. Let's take a look. And I'm sure, I think you can get koalas here, but I don't, I think koalas were planned to be a rare, like, special pet. Um, I'm just trying to think of all the pets we can get here. All the new ones. Okay, so this looks like basically the same as the desert one. Uh, let's see. Hello, Crotar City. Uh, okay, we're kind of still in the outskirts, so let's head into town. See what there is to do. See what there is to do. Adventurer, let's let's check the shops. Mo more specifically, the potion shop, because that's really the only the only place I care about at the moment. Because, uh, I mean, really there's not much else that we need, because we're such high level, there's really not a huge need for everything else. Okay, what? Okay, I'm just... The bulk of the city is this way. Mm hmm So, we've got our little... Uh, class places. Okay, yeah, Identifier, that's one of the places I wanted to go to, because we have a bunch of unspent, or unredeemed, I should say, leftovers that we need to cash in. Hello, ma'am. I actually don't know if you're a you're a guy, but let's get that legendary exceptional silver amulet. Okay, I'll take a look at that. Uh great axe we don't need. Uh silk boots we don't need. Uh boomerang we don't need. Boy, this is garbage. Okay, well let's check that amulet actually. Whoops, too far. Um not better. Not better. It's... That has a cooler name, but not much better. Okay. Lag, you can stop right now. Stop in the name of the law. Alright. Yep, yeah, it always does this during the town. I don't know why, but that's okay, guys. I might do a little bit of off-camera exploring just to load up more of the land. Oh, why is it? Oh, there's another guy in here. I was like, why is he so close? Okay, just normal. Already have a waffle. I will buy some glass flasks just to prepare for next time. Uh, and get potions and stuff. But guys, we're about 17 minutes in and I like to keep these around 20 minutes. So I think that's where we're going to leave it off for today, guys. Uh, we've explored not too much. Well, actually, wow, we traveled a lot today. Um, there's three quests that way. And then that might actually be... We'll spend some time on those quests, and that might actually be the perfect segue into the next biome, depending on how things go. But for now, guys, that's going to do it for us today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did enjoy, please consider leaving a like or subscribing for more Cube World. And as always, I'm Zombie Gaming MC, and we'll see you guys next time. Peace!